All right, we're back at the West Chase house. Four weeks of renovation, four days on the market, sold. Investors thrilled, homeowners happy. I'll show you why, come on. is building basement. Building basement. Wow, outstanding. The owner has been very gracious to let us come in after the purchase, take a look at everything, show you all the upgrades. Uh, everything turned out phenomenal. Uh, obviously we painted all the walls, all the trim. Trim is very important. A lot of people just paint the walls, but you gotta go ahead and paint the trim and the doors. And I'll tell you another thing that makes a big impact, hardware and hinges. Easy to do, makes a big impact, I suggest it for everyone. Remember I told you a big part of this budget was gonna be the bathrooms, check it out. All right, bathroom came out phenomenal. Uh, first thing you'll notice, we did save the uh, cabinets. They were really nice floating cabinets. Uh, we put a uh, quartz countertop on it. And we kept the same theme, a uh, uh, oil rub bronze uh, hardware, faucets, uh, even new uh, handles. And we, we put in the, uh, the lighted vanity mirrors. These are gonna be a staple mark for all renovations and new construction moving forward. You're gonna see these two, three years from now, it'll be in everything. Uh, tile throughout, and we did, of course, the popular freestanding tub. If you're gonna do the freestanding tub, I highly recommend you do the Roman style faucet. Uh, have it come out of the wall, not a whole lot more money, but it just gives a total, uh, total great look. And the shower, we use the frameless glass uh, shower door and wall. Uh, you'll see we complemented the tile with a nice uh, stone type shower floor. Same oil rub bronze uh, fixtures. This all looks first class, came out great. Came out great. All right, kitchen area. This is an area that we really were able to value engineered it. Saved the countertops, saved all the tile throughout, we saved the cabinets. We complemented it all with a stainless steel appliance package, including an upgraded gas cooktop. Uh, you'll see that we did all new hardware, which really gave the cabinets new life. Uh, this floating Hanging uh, pot rack was a nice uh, touch, and uh, even the, uh, the matte black faucet. So kitchen turned out great, and we're able to save a lot of money while doing it. Guest bath, we had the dual sink vanity, and uh, once again, we used uh, dual lighted mirrors. Save the uh, cabinets, quartz countertop. Here we use brush nickel hardware uh, and faucets. Thank God we had a great designer to bring everything together. Uh, shower curtain, of course we put in the new subway tile. Uh, yeah, another, another great success bathroom. You'll notice that we used a, a neutral paint color throughout. Big mistake people make is they try to uh, alternate paint colors room to room. Keep it simple, do the same paint throughout. Uh, we added a complimentary fan, LED lighting everywhere. But the cherry on top with this property is the outdoor living. If you remember, this was an Arthur Ruttenberg model home. So they already spent a ton of money on the pool area, the deck, and the landscaping. We took what they had and we made it better. We painted the whole deck, we acid washed the pool, we even replaced all their landscaping and planters, all the screens. Homeowners happy, investors thrilled. One property at a time, we're building Bayshore.